This is Nick Douglas at Cows Week 2019 and I have with me Rana who is the marketing manager for Antigua Sailing Week. So nice to have you here. Thanks for having me. Hi Nick. Oh no, no worries at all. We're very happy to have you with us because Antigua Sailing Week has donated a fantastic prize to Cows Week for Youth Day this year. Yes, uh, what we're offering is for anyone who, qu who qualifies for the Youth Prize uh, will actually win accommodations and flights for the skipper and a friend uh, to join us in Antigua for Antigua Sailing Week 2020. That is absolutely incredible. I think, uh, you know, we're trying to support youth in this sport and, and you guys are offering that beautiful prize. Yes, uh, youth sailing is actually really one of our major community initiatives in Antigua Sailing Week. We, we've um, established an, uh, a program called Youth to Keelboat. We've got lots of youth sailors who do dinghy sailing, pico sailing, RS and all of that. And uh, what we've been doing is trying to take those kids out of that environment, pair them with keelboats during our regatta and just get them to kind of move forward in their sailing careers or even their sailing you know activities so um, with that in mind when we uh, approach when we were approached by cows with their youth program we we're like this is perfect match and it'll be the second time we're, we're um, working on an initiative um, a couple of years ago we had the youth from the Greg City Academy come down and sail with us so that's you know that was our first one and this is our second uh, foray into it Fantastic. It's great to see that you're supporting youth, as, as I mentioned. Um, but Cows Week, why Cows Week? Why is it such a perfect match? I mean, it's a quintessential English event. It's, it's so renowned. How does it match with Antigua Sailing Week? Well, it, it seems um, from my observations that Antigua and Cows just has a really long-standing connection. The, the, we have a booth here at the, at the festival and the number of people who have come by and said, we've sailed in Antigua, we know Antigua, we, we holiday in Antigua, we have family in Antigua, we've been married, you know, and it just goes on, goes on and on. And, you know, similarity in size is an island, not population. Uh, the weather today is very... It's, um, looks You're still wearing a familiar. jacket. I'm still wearing a jacket, but it's sunny. <laughs> it's sunny and the skies are blue. So uh, that's that's a plus. But I think uh, I think in, in general, it's, it's just a really close relationship that we share uh, both two one week regattas. And here we are. Oh, fantastic. So I'm, I'm really looking forward to seeing who takes out the youth prize tomorrow and who will win a prize to go to Antigua Sailing Week with a friend as well. All expenses. Yes, expenses paid. And then in addition, also part of the celebration is we have the youth uh, reggae in the park party this evening at um, Shepherd's Wharf. Uh, it'll be in the sugar store and that's open for all under 25 um, participants to come by, have a great time. Uh, we'll be basically bringing a, a pop-up version of our reggae party here to Cows. Oh, sounds like a plan. We'll hopefully see you at the reggae, reggae party later on. And congratulations to all our youth sailors and those who are supporting them to get out on the water this week in Cows.